Hey Tankers, Bonsai Duck here. Today we have a submission from Night Dog from the H Solo Clan in his AMX 1375. He is on Marabanka in a standard battle in a tier 8, tier 7, tier 6 game. Night Dog has uh, helped me out greatly with this channel. Uh, he, I think he was my first subscriber and has always kept sending me in videos and Help me, uh, helping me perfect the videos and the sound and everything else. He's just done a lot of work to help me get this channel up and rolling, and I greatly appreciate that, Night Dog. So he sent this today to me, and he was like, I think I got a new series for you. And I said, okay, what is it? And he says, we're going to call it Heartbreaker. And uh, I haven't seen this yet, but according to Night Dog, this is a Heartbreaker. So Night Dog, spawned in the south. Looks like you're headed over here to the early light spotting area right around the six line six seven line so take it away buddy amx 1375s running the 75 millimeter gun with 135 alpha and 144 penetration and a 202 penetration on the gold round got good spotting he spots a tire but of course the t50-2 is already up there and uh, okay he runs into you Get a shed on the O and I. Oh, oh, I no penetration. Got an E25 heading your way. Little cockroach tank. I love those tanks. I hate playing against them, but I do love mine. <laughs> EVR Hotch on the backside. Right now, you're kind of caught. You got the E25 over there who's. Just trying to, who wants to machine gun you down. It looks like they sent a lot of lights over to the magical forest. Along with the King Tiger backup. Night Dog says, I've had enough of this area. I'm, I'm bugging out. And sometimes knowing when you're going to bug out is the best thing, Night. Sometimes knowing when you're going to bug out. That's a, that's a rule. No, when it's not safe to go somewhere. <laughs> or to stay where you're at. I still suffer from that sometimes. Alright, so it's a two-to-one game. Your team's in the lead right now. I think I would have reloaded, but... Uh, yeah. Okay, so now are we going to be able to get some shots here? Night Dog's not known for his YOLO suicide runs. Oh, there we go. Oh, nice. I don't know how you hit that, but okay. <laughs> uh, Scorpion's looking at you, buddy. Yeah, Scorpion G was looking at you for lunch. All right, well, they're pushing through the magical forest while your team is uh, lollygagging its way around the 1-2 line. Right, there's that T50 again. Not sure what his deal is with you. Oh, it gets a scorpion on the run. There's another shot into him. And he gets spotted. Hits the reload. Scorpion G's over there behind that building. And it looks like you guys have managed to stop their push through the magical forest. Yeah, we'll get up on there and get a shot into that RHM. Oh, 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 26 E5 on the hill. Are you going to be able to? Oh, I, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, he's down. I think you would have had it, but uh, obviously I think your mouse is still acting a little spastic. Oh, there, yeah, that scorpion wanted you. Now the question is, is he even looking at you? Oh, he is. He is looking at you. So, um, yeah. That's one thing I, I'm kind of noticing is you're not... I always try to, even if I'm not aiming at him, just try to get my, my, my pickle on him so that I can, you know, if, if I can get a shot, I'm fine. If not, great. But at least that way I know which way he's looking. Yeah, he wants a piece of you. He definitely wants a piece of you. But he's taking a hit for doing that, too. 
Now he's heading behind that building. And he's taking an arty shot. And it looks like Night Dog's gonna move in on him. Come in behind him. There's a tracking shot. There's a shot into the back of the turret. And he's down. Hit the reload and move. Hit the reload. There you go. Alright, so six to four. Everything's looking really good. I'm not quite sure where the heartbreak comes into play, but I think it's coming. Got a King Tiger capture over there who's pretty full of health. And uh, your ARL44 looks like he's on his last legs. You're going to move up. Oh, there's another. There's that Jackson again. There's a shot into him. There's another one. He's, oh, armor not penetrated. Ah, 50 got him for you, but nice work on him. All right. Okay, so now it's 8 to 6. They're making a comeback. T-44 hiding back there. Night Dog's pretty much played one, one spot of the map the whole game here. Oh, T-29, no, no penetration. Oh, that that hit him. It had to hit him. Gonna hit the reload. There you go. Alright, so the Oods is yelling for help. It's now 8 to 9. Somewhere in the last 30 seconds to a minute, you guys have managed to give up <laughs> three dead. <laughs> All right, so T-44 is moving in on the Scorpion and the SU-100. Can you go over there and help him? That might be a good choice. You can get in there and help that guy. This point. Oh, there's the King Tiger. He's falling way back. No, 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 no. Focus on the... F oh, the 44, the 44. Okay, going for the Tiger. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah. Uh, P43. She had to gone over there and help that with the T44. I'm sorry, Knight. The, the tiger was a was a target for you, but you needed those two TDs. All right, now he's down. So you got the P43. He's over there somewhere. The other 1357 is over there harassing your hoods. All right, watch out for the trees, buddy. Don't telegraph where you're at. There's the King Tiger. Oh, there's a shot. And he's down. All right, so get out of there. Start going forward so the Artie doesn't target you. All right. Got the reload going. You're down to your last four shells of... of Armor penetration. After that, you're down to 8 HE. -E. 11 to 11. What are we going to do, Knight? What is Night Dog going to do? He's going to swing around to the east side. See if he can pop up on this P-43. Oh, P-43 is down. You guys, you have an advantage here. t 29s back there harassing your M-44. Yeah, yeah, back to base, buddy. Back to base. Uh, no, no, yeah, go back there and help. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> I guess we're going Artie hunting. My guess is the Artie was up by, it's probably up by where the Dicker Max was last seen. If he was smart, he's gotten the heck out of there. That Dicker Max is probably poked up in a bush somewhere just waiting for you guys to light up. So, 12 to 13 game. Game is not over yet. Although you both, he's 100% and you're, what, three quarters maybe? All right, so you know one of them's on base. That's probably the T-29. And, uh, oh, 
there's the M44. Get that pit bull. Get that. Oh. That's that that's an issue with your mouse, buddy. I, I don't know if you've gotten that gaming mouse pad yet, but I'd seriously consider going and getting it. Because <laughs> you just could, you couldn't get your aiming point down there. Alright, so the SU 100s charging back. He's just going headlong into it. He could really use you to spot up there. Now we're down to the HE. Good reset though. Good reset round. Oh, come on. Nine seconds. They're both on there. Come on. Is this the heartbreak? Is this the heartbreak? Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> that. Oh, and you would have gotten the reset. All right, that was a heartbreaker. That that was a heartbreaker because you guys definitely, I think you had that game. You would have been able to get it. You, you know, oh, oh. Um, let's see. What what? The T forty four, I think, was your was your number was your first mistake. Going after the King Tiger instead of the T forty four and allowing the T forty four to take out your Scorpion. I think that was your. That was the 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 the, the moment where the, the the battle went south on you. Um, then of course not getting your aiming point onto that um, that M44 and taking a shot from him. But um, anyway, uh, master class second uh, second second level master <laughs> class two. Uh, you got a fighter duelist. Fire for effect and an Orkins medal for destroying two or more enemy tanks or tank destroyers in a light tank in a single battle. 38,299 in credits, 1,484 in experience and a bond. You did 2,248 in damage and four kills gives you a base XP of 614. You had the highest amount of damage, the highest base XP and the highest kills. You fired 27 shots, 24 of them found their mark and 18 of them penetrated. You got 389 from 300 meters out, and you managed to detect 240. Span, well, you went through so much ammo, and uh, so that, that was going to be costly. I think you may have used a repair kit, but I'm not sure. But you got some experience, too. So, it, it, Heartbreaker, yes, definitely a Heartbreaker. Uh, like I said, I think if you had taken on that T-44 and helped those other two tanks get him taken care of, uh, would have changed the game. At least then you would have had a couple more TDs. Maybe one of them would have gone back towards base to, to slow up that T-29. But uh, the other choice was when you were uh, going after the RD instead of going back towards base to, to maybe help out your RD. So you're the light tank. You're the speed. You know, it kind of it's kind of upon you to do those things. But it was definitely a heartbreaker to lose that close to being able to reset the cap. So... Anyway, that's Night Dog in his AMX 1375 on Marbanka in a standard battle. If you like the video, hit the like button. Keep those videos coming. I greatly appreciate the support. This is Bonsai Duck out.